So one of the cool places I love going uh, is really close to the studio here in Sausalito. It's this uh, place they repair ships and old boats and there's always broken pieces of uh, hulls and masts and colored parts of <laughs> sailboats and stuff laying around and it's all worn away and it's outside and there's just and tarps and it's just the most beautiful rich colors all patinaed um, from sitting around near the ocean or being in the ocean and um, I was down there the other day and I was like I just love this place and I had forgotten my phone so I didn't even have a camera but I just was I just like going there I'll just walk through there and I always get intrigued and I realized it's because it connects to my art. So this is Nicholas Wilton at Art to Life. And today I'm talking about um, how to integrate your life more with your art because it makes it better. It, it makes it stronger. And I'm realizing this more and more and more. And I started thinking about this, all the ways that my art, uh, I've made connections to it. Like it's no longer just this thing that I kind of do and it's kind of life of its own. It relates, uh, and <laughs> so case in point, <laughs> these colors behind me, both of these, by the way, um, uh, are colors that relate to my work. These podcast things and these vlog things that I do, they're, they're done in relationship to what I'm making. This pink color and this aqua color, <laughs> are totally connected to my paintings upstairs. And I get more into it if I choose this gray with this pink. It's like it's a way that I connect to what I'm doing in my art. And everything starts to relate to that. I haven't even noticed it, like I now choose music. Like I have playlists for the kind of art I'm making because it feels like I find music that feels like when I'm driving around in the car, I'm listening for different kinds of music and then I'm tagging it that relate and fit to what I'm making. And, and it's just like there's so many, and people are the same way. I've met people and I'm attracted to certain kinds of people that, and, and experiences that are, that are connected to the, the way my work feels right now. It's really, really fascinating. So this is, this is kind of like I think a really great idea about like how to develop your work more deeply it to just immerse into it to bring it in to connect it the more connections to your into your day that your art has the more sort of um, momentum it it's cr is created so that's kind of the idea here and uh we kind of already do this I'm sure you know we notice things that are like our work but if you just really start consciously adjusting things you know the way your house is uh decorated or the or where you go for a walk and always relating that back um to this to this sort of like common theme in your life which is which is your art it's a way to make this to gather momentum and create potency about what you're making there's more stuff that's coming into it that's making it more powerful let me know in the comments what you think about this and how you bring your life into your art. I've got a really cool uh, podcast coming out on Wednesday with this guy, this amazing young photographer, Jonah Allen. All he shoots is, it's all water, you guys. It's all ocean. And he lives this life in the ocean. He surfs, swims <laughs> in it. He studies weather patterns at night. Um, he's He's actually just like living in the ocean and he's photographing it and his work's amazing. So that's coming out on Wednesday. There's a link down below. Check it out. It's kind of, uh, it's pretty inspiring. I, I found it really inspiring, the conversation. So there's, check out that link below to subscribe to the Art to Life podcast. And I hope your Sunday is going to go really, really well. And by the way, for those of you who are new here, um, we have the amazing Art to Life free artist Facebook group. Tons of people doing all kinds of cool stuff from all over the world, and you're invited. Okay, thanks a lot. Hey, everyone. If you found this helpful, I have a whole lot more to teach, share, and inspire you with every single week. So please join the Art to Life YouTube channel by clicking the subscribe button below. Okay, great. Let's do this.